What is a species? Scientists group living organisms into different kinds called species. A species is a group of organisms that all share the same characteristics. Each species has a two-word Latin name. What is variation? Variation is differences between individual members of a species. The plant kingdom is classified into four major groups, mosses, ferns, conifers, and flowering plants. Mosses. Mosses are very small plants. Most of them live in damp and shady places. They don't produce flowers, but they produce spores for reproduction. They have very thin leaves that dry out easily. Ferns. Ferns are also similar to mosses. They grow to in shady places, but they are much bigger than mosses. Some of them grow so big that they are called tree ferns. Conifers. Most conifers grow into large trees. They usually have tough, narrow leaves called needles. They don't have proper flowers. They reproduce using seeds. Flowering plants. These plants reproduce using seeds that are produced inside flowers. Fish. Fish are vertebrates with fins. Their skin is covered with scales and they breathe using gills. Fish lay eggs in the water. Amphibians. Amphibians include frogs, toads, newts, and salamanders. Amphibian adults live on land and they breathe using lungs. They have four limbs. Amphibians lay eggs in the water and their young are called tadpoles. Reptiles. Reptiles are vertebrates with scaly skin. Most of them have four legs, although snakes have lost their legs. Some reptiles live on land, but some, such as crocodile, live in water. Reptiles reproduce by laying eggs on land. The dinosaurs were also reptiles. Birds. Birds are vertebrates with wings, feathers, and a beak. They lay eggs on land. Mammals. This is the group that we belong to. Mammals are vertebrates with hair. Mammals give birth to live young, which are fed on milk from the mother. Invertebrates are animals without backbones. We will be discussing three of them, mollusks, annelids, and arthropods. Mollusks. Mollusks are animals with a soft body. They use a muscular foot to move around. Some of them have shells. Some examples of them are slugs, snails, and octopus. Annelids. Annelids are worms with bodies divided up into rings or also known as segments. Annelids do not have legs, but they do have tiny bristles called chepe. An example of annelid is earthworm. Arthropods. Arthropods are invertebrates with jointed legs. Their bodies are divided into segments, and they have a skeleton outside of their bodies. The skeleton is called an exoskeleton.